Hello. Welcome. I'm Dr. Abstract, and we're going to code with Zim. So let's uh, code a button. Last time, I think we saw a list. Uh, let's see a button. So that looks like this. New button. Dot center. On the stage automatically. There she be. And uh, if we press the button, we, we should maybe do something with it. Let's store it in a variable. Const button, lowercase, is equal to that. And then what we can do is capture a tap event. So that looks like this. Um, well, we could say dot tap. And then we have an arrow function inside there. That's uh, a little format to, to run a function. It's called an arrow function. Whatever's in between these squiggly brackets, that's what we'll do. What we're going to do is we're going to move the button every time we tap on it. Does that sound like fun? <laughs> so we can locate the button at a random stage width minus the button width. Button dot width. Hopefully you're not going, oh, math. I just saw a minus sign. So uh, and rand the stage height. That's H minus the button dot height. H-E-I-G-H-T. There we go. And each time we should update the stage as well. Stage dot update like so. Um, if we change something, you ready? Boop. Uh oh, loc is not defined. What are we gonna loc? Button. Uh, button dot loc. There we go. So we have to locate the button when we press it. Okay. Oh my gosh! Look at that go. Oh. Uh, yeah, that's all right. It just pops to that random thing. Do you want to animate it to a random thing? So rather than loc, we can animate, animate, and we'll animate the X to this random thing. Let's drop this down so we can see this stuff. And we'll animate the Y to that random thing. And then we've got squigglies ending in there. So now when we locate it, it's going to animate it to that location in one second. Uh, do you want a little bit faster? How about a bit faster? So we're going to animate those properties in 0.5 seconds. Boom, boom, boom. Choop, choop, choop. Do you want to do a back out? So I think that would look nice. And with a back out ease. Or we could do a bounce ease. Do you want to see what a bounce would look like? It might look kind of funny. But let's do a bounce out. Bounce out. Ready? Boing. That didn't go very far. <laughs> there it is bouncing. Boing, boing. Okay, yeah, get the idea. I am Dr. Abstract. If you want to have fun with this too, you can come to zimjs.com slash teaser. And if you want to find out anything more about Zim, hit that little Z up top and you'll get all sorts of uh, information at the Zim site. I am Dr. Abstract. Have a great day or night. Cheers. <laughs> Bye.